El verbo ir. El verbo ir significa to go. Las conjugaciones del verbo ir. Yo voy, I go. Tu vas, you go. El va, he goes. Ella va, she goes. Usted va, you go formal. Nosotros vamos, we go. Vosotros vais, you all go in España. Ellos van, they go. Ellas van, they go. Y ustedes van, you all go. La preposición a. Cuando tenemos el verbo ir, la preposición a siempre está después de ir. Cuando tenemos a con el artículo el, es al. Nunca decimos a él. Siempre decimos al. Práctica aquí. Completa la, fra la frase con la forma correcta del verbo ir usando las conjugaciones correctas. Después, pongan sus respuestas en Dropbox de Haiku. So we've already discussed that the verb ir means to go, which usually refers to someone that is going to a particular location. However, we can also use ir to describe what we plan on doing in the near future. We do that by using ir a con el infinitivo. Here are the steps that we'll follow if we want to use ir a con el infinitivo. The example that we'll use will be we are going to study. The first thing that we'll do is we'll conjugate the verb ir for nosotros. So it's nosotros vamos. Step two requires that we add the preposition a after our conjugation. So now we have nosotros vamos a. And finally, we add the infinitive of what it is that we are going to do in the near future. Since we are going to study, our sentence is nosotros vamos a estudiar. Try translating these sentences to Spanish using ir a plus the infinitive. When you're finished, send it to the Dropbox and Haiku. Adios!